Well, the students benefited enormously from working in the community. They were able to have some real hands-on experience with community members. And they learned a lot. They learned everything from what the issues are that face different organizations to the realities of trying to schedule meetings with people's very busy schedules and uh, what kinds of uh, barriers there were to getting things done. So that was uh, an enormous amount of learning. And the community partners really served as teachers and mentors to the students. I think the community partners benefited a great deal too because they were able to tap into the students' enthusiasm and uh, dedication to the projects. They were also able to find out a lot more because the students were working with them and putting their energies toward their research questions. And uh, one of the biggest benefits was the collaboration between the university students and the community partners as a, a bridge that really ties the university and the larger community together as a community as a whole. Just to say, as being the first community speaker, how much we've enjoyed having somebody help take our project further along. And we have a long ways to go. There are a lot of groups in the community, and Rowan, who worked with us, contacted people that we really had had no formal contact with before, and has brought some ideas to help us in design and ideas for a new library. The library knew that it needed a new, it needed something needed to change at that point. It already had been going through a process for several years of, of trying to gather some information um, to, to help that move that process along. And so I came in to a project that was already happening, and my, my role in that was to figure out with a, a group of library board members and administration and, and patrons of what kind of knowledge needed to be thought after next, and so we ended up contacting four different community groups and doing some some focus group activities with two of them, and so that was um, as far as we got with the project this quarter, but it was really interesting. I think one of the most rewarding details that I could share is that one of the people that we contacted because of this project now wants to be in that primary group and has a lot of background in library renovation and, and used to do that for a living. Um, and so I think it's really great that that person would not have maybe come into this group um, because enthusiasm and knowledge if that, if, you know, if this project hadn't taken off. So. Students reported at the end of the course that they felt that they had benefited by learning real skills that they could use when they go away from the university. They felt that this was something that they could add to their resume that was really going to make a difference for them. And having the PAR skills and the PAR experience has opened a lot of doors to these students. They have more opportunities now. And they report that it's one of the courses that they feel is bringing really uh, practical kinds of applications to where they're going with their future lives.